for anybody that's going through a hard time in their life. I have a story to tell you. There's a creature that lives out in the ocean. It has two shells and a soft center. Well, one day, somebody kicked sand into this creature, and most of it bounced off the shell, but one grain got in between the shells. And it was painful, and it was irritating, and the sea creature could not push the sand grain out no matter how hard it tried. And so it cried, because the sand hurt. I mean, it just, it hurt. It's irritating. So it cried, and it cried, and it tried to push the sand out, and it cried some more. But it couldn't get rid of the sand. So its tears started to build up kind of a surface around the sand grain. And the more tears this creature shed, the thicker this membrane got. Until eventually the sand stopped being painful. It was still there, but it stopped being painful and it could carry on with its life. That creature is an oyster, and that irritant in the sand became a pearl. Now, how many times in your life have you gone through irritations and, and sadness and bad things happening to you, bullying, discrimination, all those things? Be an oyster. Take that pain, take those tears and those sand grains and make something beautiful. Make something beautiful out of that, if you can. These are real pearls in the shape of infinity. They're a string of pearls. They belong to my grandma, and they're real. They are 100% real. That's why they're kind of dingy. They've been in a box for like 40 years. But your life is a string of pearls. And what are you going to do with it? What are you going to do with these pearls? Are you going to keep putting them away in a box where nobody can see them? Are you going to turn them into art? Are you going to turn them into something? Are you going to make them into poetry, music, a story, an anti-bullying movement? Your pain is pearls. Your pain means something. Even if it seems like it's meaningless now, maybe a year from now, 10 years, 20 years, 30, 40, a century from now, if you're still alive in a century, I mean, who knows? You know, your pearls, they're special and you can make something with them. This is your life. This is your struggle. You can make it beautiful. I believe in you.